add the wheat, the oats, and the sugars. Uh, we mash them from 146 degrees to 158. The hotter we mash, the less fermentable those sugars are. So those sugars stay in the beer with body and sweetness. Whereas something like the Saison is fermented down at 146, so it all just dries out. You want a very dry beer out of that. So at the end of an hour, we rinse those grains, send them from the mash tun to the tank in the corner, which is the kettle. One of the big things we like around here is we try to reuse everything. Uh, reusing the pallets of the bar top over there, reusing pallets to make over there. But we have uh, at the end of the mash process, a local farm in Jackson that comes by, picks up the grain, and uses pick feed. So again, reuse. Turn the kettle, boil in there for about an hour, and hops early on for bitterness, and hops later on for aroma. I'm filtering it. I'm adding chloride. I'm adding calcium. I'm adding sulfate. Raising the pH, lowering the pH. So it's more like the water of London or Dublin or Munich or Dresden or San Diego. Uh, that profile affects the perceived bitterness of the beer, the yeast vitality, the clarity, it's the entire chemistry behind brewing. So we go from the chemistry on that end to the biochem and biology on this end. I gotta ask you a question. Yeah, what's up? Do you love chemistry in high school? No, I loved it in college though. Now, if you went back to high school before college, yeah. would it be more interesting if this was a class in college? It sort of was. I studied food science in college okay. and then specialized in food fermentation. I sort of made my own degree and interned at a few local breweries in college to learn more of this. So, uh, yeah, obviously when I was learning chemistry in high school, uh, I hated everything about it. I don't care about any of this. I don't care about molar this or any of that. Uh, now, at the same time, I wish I knew parts per million a little bit better, molar a little bit better. But I know the chemistry behind it. Yeah. Interesting. So we have biochem and bio 